everyone so today i have actually found the uh thoroughbreds that we were looking for so um i've got one black one for the uh lesson program and i've got a flea bitten and a seal bay that i will be rescuing um so yeah i found a breeder from the seal bay and the flea bitten was uh starved from ignorance well here's the seal bay um he is absolutely adorable um and i'm pretty sure i actually still have a um bay to come over because that will be my new eventing horse along with pocky um if you guys have name suggestions for the rescue horses then i don't mind because <laughs> it's hard to find them sometimes but he is a gelding um he doesn't have a name yet he will probably be put in dressage and jumping um oh it's okay um this is why i needed to rescue them and this is the bay um this is a mare uh she doesn't have a name yet either um and flea bitten has a name which i'll explain once we get to her um but she's absolutely adorable her mane is actually like a bay color it's not um black which is really cool to me for some reason <laughs> um but she's very pretty she doesn't have like uh white sock markings oh okay um there's a lot of training to do though okay um this is the seal bay i'm gonna be riding him today um he's having trouble walking forward all right there we go i think he got scared of the bush or something um it was i checked his shoes and stuff it was perfectly fine oh don't run me into the tree okay good boy good boy there's a huge wheat field now um which is helpful with hay and stuff so i guess that's why they have it there uh we are not going to be running through that there's a lot of horses in that arena all right um i'll see you guys once we set up the course all right the course is all set up we're gonna be doing some um pretty big jumping because he has some jumping in the um past household he was at so um he's pretty good at this i've been told how high you can jump the highest you can jump is the other jump over there so we're gonna do that last good boy good boy Good boy. Good boy. It's the triples that he needs help with. Good boy. Good boy. Alright, this is the yellow jump. That's his, um, like, I guess, max of how high he's jumped. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, these are the bigger jumps now. Get. Good boy. Alright, someone left their horse there. Um, let's go over some more jumps over here. Good boy, steady. Steady. This canter is very bouncy. Good boy. Steady. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we ran through those poles. He's just jumping freely right now. Get. Ooh, okay, we ran through those poles. Good boy, look steady. Ooh. Okay, we'll go around again. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, um. Good boy. It's the D. Oh. Um, anyways. 
boy. Good boy. Good boy. There we go. Okay, we had to turn away from that drum because he was just refusing. Good boy. Good boy. Get. Good boy. Alright, we're gonna do the bigger jump soon. Good boy. Good boy. I'm trying to correct his lead right now. Good boy. There we go. Okay, that was the biggest jump that he has done. So I'm not going to push him anymore. Good boy. All right. Um, we just finished the ride with him. That was very chaotic. Um, there's definitely some training to do, but that's the whole point. Uh, and now that we've finished the ride, we're going to be introducing the flea bitten horse. Her name is Forrest. Um, she's a beautiful flea bitten thoroughbred and she is one of my next um, rescue horses. So uh, my project horses are still being worked on. Okay, this is Forrest. Um, you can tell she's very beautiful. Her mane is all braided up, so it's not gonna get dirty or anything. Um, so is her tail, so everything is uh, protected, so it's all clean. Um, I think something we need to work on is her hooves, because they did say that they were slightly damaged, which is fine. I can um, definitely work with that. Uh, I will not be riding her um, because of the hoof injuries. We're just going to walk her over to the pasture um get her all comfortable and let her see her surroundings um she's gonna be in the pasture behind the bay horse i really need to give them names <laughs> um but yeah so i think forest is the only one that has a name um and there's two or three of my other rescue horses that are from the first video that don't have names and then there's the thoroughbred that doesn't have names all right um i think that i'll probably once her hoof is all cured um she will be a show jumper um but if that's not fit for her then we'll do something simple like flat work um but i'm bringing her over the hay so she can eat all right here she is she's just gonna eat some hay now probably um She's just standing there, I think she's watching something, but, uh, so, I think this view is actually really pretty. I like the way they changed the paddocks right now, um, they look pretty cool, and it's much neater. Okay, thank you all so much for watching, um, I hope you have a good day slash night, and if you want an update on the horses, um, then let me know, and I'll see you later. Bye!